Hello kids! You are now watching Re Learnings. I am Teacher Rina. I will be your partner in acquiring new knowledge. Are you ready for our lesson for today? Yes, teacher! Hmm. Very good! So just sit back, relax, and enjoy our lesson for today. Changes of materials from solid to liquid. Do you know that there are changes that take place in materials? Some solids can change into liquids. Liquids can change into solids. Solids and liquids can change into gases. The question is, how do these changes occur in materials? Let's find out. Do you know what is this? Hmm. Very good. This is a thermometer. A thermometer is used to measure the temperature of an object. Have you seen one? Yes, teacher! Remember that low temperature indicates coldness, while high temperature indicates Hotness. The temperature can increase or decrease. When it is increasing, this process is called heating. When it is decreasing, this process is called cooling. The temperature of a boiling water is 100 degree Celsius. And remember that water will freeze at 0 degree Celsius. For our lesson for today, you will learn that there are some solids that can become liquids when exposed to heat. Look at the butter before it is heated. Is it a solid? Very good. The butter is a solid. What happens to it after it is heated. How does solid change into liquid? Study the butter being heated below. When butter is heated on the frying pan, it melts because it is exposed to heat. Thus, its temperature increases. Butter is an example of solid. When heated, it becomes liquid. There are some solid materials 
that can be changed into liquids by heating or exposing them to sunlight or warm air. Ice cream, ice cubes, and butter melt and change into liquids when left in an open place where there is sunlight and warm air. This process is called melting or liquefaction. Now, let's have an activity. I want you to get your paper and pencil. Are you ready? Yes, teacher! Number one. When ice is cold, it melts. When ice is cold, it melts. True or false? Number two. Sugar becomes liquid when heated. Sugar becomes liquid when heated. True or false? Number three. Crayon will still be solid when heated. Crayon will still be solid when heated. True or false? Number four. Candles will melt when lighted. Candles will melt when lighted. True or false? Number five. When you hold an ice cube, it will melt in your hands. When you hold an ice cube, it will melt in your hands. True or false? Remember, phase change can happen when the temperature of the material is increased. Phase change can happen when the temperature of the material is increased. Melting happens by increasing the temperature of the materials. Melting happens by increasing the temperature of the materials. And solids can be changed into liquids by melting. Solids can be changed into liquids by melting. I'm going to read a story to you. One fine morning, two kids bought an ice cream. Mmm, the ice cream is so sweet. Yes, I know, but my teeth hurt. So, what will you do? Uh, I will eat this after an hour. Oh dear, you should eat your ice cream right away. Because if you don't, your ice cream will melt. Right, I think I have to eat this when my toothache goes away. Now, let's have an activity. I want you to get your paper and pencil. Analyze each item carefully. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Write it on your paper. Number 1. The process of changing solid into liquid is called blank. The process of changing solid into liquid is called blank. A. Decreasing B. 
heating, C, increasing, D, melting, A, decreasing, B, heating, C, increasing, D, melting. Number two. There are some solids that can be changed into liquids by simply exposing them to A. Cold air B. Moonlight C. Sunlight D. Moisture There are some solids that can be changed into liquids by simply exposing them to blank. A. Cold air B. Moonlight C. Sunlight D. Moisture Number 3 The following materials can be changed into liquid except blank. A. Ice cream B. Margarine C. Ice cubes D. Sugar The following materials can be changed into liquid except A. Ice cream B. Margarine C. Ice cubes D. Sugar Number 4 which of the following materials melts when heated? A. Milk powder B. Salt C. White sugar D. Wax Which of the following materials melts when heated? A. Milk powder B. Salt C. White sugar D. Wax Number 5 What is the other word for melting? What is the other word for melting? A. Cooling B. Changing C. Heating D. Liquefaction What is the other word for melting? A. Cooling B. Changing C. Heating D. Liquefaction That's the end of our lesson for today. I hope that you've learned something from our topic. Remember, when there is willingness to learn, you will acquire knowledge easier. Goodbye! Stay tuned for other videos.